Hey guys, Matty from Revenge here. Today, we're going to talk about using squid as bait. Hey guys, so there's basically two things that we're going to look at today. Number one is using the squid hole, so rigging this as a whole squid and using it like that. And the other one's cutting it into strips and making a strip bait. So for a whole squid, what do I do? I run a twin hook rig. I don't really like twin hook rigs as a rule of thumb, but for these big squid they're a really good choice. There's a heap of different ways you can rig these. Sometimes the top hook will slide. Um, basically, I like to snell them, but I, I feel like the snells are a really good option. They're super strong, they're easy to tie, they're quick. Anyway, what you want to do from here is just roughly work out your hook placement. So if you look at the squid, um, you can see there, I definitely want a hook in the top of the head here. If you don't get a hook in the top of the head, you will lose the head. It will fall off, there's no question about it, but you can see there, first hook's through the top of the head, there's heaps of barb showing, there's heaps of hook, and then the second one, we just come up to the top, into where the mantle is, and we pin it straight through that mantle as well. And then that's it guys, that is basically your hook placement, as you can see, that's going to sit nicely in the water, it's not going to spin. It looks like a really good bait ready for a fish to come and take it. I've just taken the head off and I've just given it a bit of a clean in the sink. The main reason is, clearly I'm in my office, I, I don't want to get ink and squid everywhere. So, I've just given it a bit of a tidy up. Your next step then, is just to cut halfway through the tube, basically the whole way. Um, you don't want to cut the whole way through it. So you can see there guys, we've just cleaned the squid up a little bit, it's, you know, basically butterflied I suppose you could call it. All I'd do now is just cut off strips, I find triangles such as this seem to be a really good um, option. So basically to rig that, all I'd do, I've got a 4.0 hook here, any hook between say a 3.0 and a 5.0 um, for these would be ideal. Same story, just a short leader, that's 40 pound once again. And just pin it through the very top of the um, strip there. And you can see that, guys. That's a nice bait. It's all ready. Um, good to go. Super appealing for a kingfish or jew or whatever you're fishing for. Um, so there you go, guys. Pretty simple. I hope you can see there the process for rigging either a whole squid or cutting it into strips. Um, by all means, get out there, give it a go, see which one you prefer, but be aware the fish may change day to day, so what works today may not be tomorrow's best option. Thanks again for watching the video, guys. If you just haven't subscribed to my channel, please hit the button. Thanks, cheers.